What's up, Tower Rivers? Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to the channel of Car Enthusiasts. Today, in front of us is the Mahindra Thar Earth Edition, a brand new edition launched by Mahindra of the Thar guys. Uh, and uh, before we get started, like the video if you enjoyed it, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and press the bell notification icon so you don't miss any of my future uploads, guys. We are at Royal Motors Mahindra Kolkata. The address of the showroom will be in the detail in the description below. All the details will be given below the contact number, each and everything. And if you're planning on buying a Mahindra vehicle, do come over here and check it out. Take a test drive and book your car accordingly. Let's get started with the video straight away, guys. So, what do we have in front of us? What are the changes? Everything will be explored. But first, this is the biggest change. This uh, golden uh, color that Mahindra has come up with. Uh, basically, to give it off, give it a more desertish kind of a vibe, as we saw it in the advertisement as well. And uh, it's kind of a sandy golden color, you know, if you want to call it that. And it looks really nice. It suits the car, and uh, kind of makes it look more aggressive rather than the bl black and the red that we have seen so much. I think this unique color makes it look a little bit more premium, in my opinion. Okay, so you can see this big grill over here. These grill slats are finished in body color over here. This is finished in black. All right. Big thar litten over here on the bumper, guys, as you can see. And uh, these are your DRLs over here, finished in white. You get halogen lights in this, finished in yellow. Uh, you get your fog lamps as well, finished in yellow. Okay, these are the bonnet locks, as you can see in front of me. The engine underneath the hood churns 130 horsepower with 300 Nm of torque, which is a turbocharged diesel engine with a capacity of 2.2 liters. Okay. So that is this engine specification. Uh, this is what it is from the front. Now let's move to the side, guys. So basically, you can see this full body gliding, the large chunky wheel arches over here. Look at that step running, and uh, it's connected all the way to the back. So very, it's a like it's made for off-roading, guys. Of course, I mean you get all-terrain tires also with this MRF car Wanderer Milta. Because these these are 18-inch wheels, guys. Okay. And uh, these alloys are very aggressive looking, very good looking in my opinion. Look at those disc brakes, huge disc brakes. What do you guys think? What are your thoughts? Do let me know. 255, 65 R18 guys. So chunky tires in this, okay. This is your antenna setup over here. Big RVMs, Thar written right over here. Your don't opening knob is finished in black, not body color. Earth edition ka badging up there on the B pillar. And uh, this is how it is. Uh, this is the view of the rear glass over here we will get inside in a bit and we'll explore this is a fuel lid which opens uh, with your key so vintage opening system has me obviously guys this is the first time we are doing uh, the video of Athar on our channel and uh, we are doing the earth edition straight away okay so leave a like if you are enjoying this video subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and uh, press the bell notification so you don't miss any of my future uploads and much more interesting content obviously is on its way in the future so make sure you are subscribed to our channel all right so you can see the real lights over here led treatment is given over here thar is written over here all right this is your spare wheel treatment over here at the back which makes it look really good in our opinion what do you, what do you guys think let me know your thoughts in the comments as you can see this is also very big and chunky over here reflector treatment reflector treatment Parking sense is one and two over here. There's no rear parking camera, guys. Only two rear parking sensors. Front maybe parking sensors. This does not get blind spot monitoring, a dash, nothing whatsoever. It's a very raw car. Uh, it is a 4x4 off-roader, proper off-roader. 4x4 ka badging bhi hai pe, as you can see. You do get a rear defogger, okay, but no rear wiper. That's not present over here. So let's open the rear, guys. This is how it opens, okay. And uh, this particular portion opens like this. And then you can basically open this up like this. Okay, with just a little bit of pull, you can just this this goes up, slides up. Okay, hydraulic struts over here, as you can see. This is the story of the boot. All right, you get your warning triangle and your punch change kit and everything over here. There's no storage underneath this. Okay, plus you can increase the boot carrying capacity as this is a 50 50 split. Okay, so that is another neat thing. You get a high mounted stop lamp over here. And now we're going to close this. So, you can close the door like And uh, you can close the door like this. And that's how it is. That's pretty neat. What do you guys think? What do you guys think of the rear design, the boot and everything? Do let me know your thoughts in the comments below, guys. Tell me, any Thar fanboys watching this, you know, let me know your thoughts. If you own the Thar, how's the experience been of this car? Please let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And share this video to your uh, friends and family. 
if they are planning on buying a thar especially this edition okay you get your regular wipers over there the wiper washer the system is over there and uh, that's about it from the exterior guys let me know your thoughts what do you think of this car and plus it's a four star safety rating aata hai guys in global ncap so that is another thing going for this vehicle and i really like this car personally uh, it looks very aggressive looks very rugged and uh, it's a proper 4x4 you can take it off roading and it is uh, it feels well made as well you know it can take uh, the abuse if you are taking it through rough terrains it definitely looks and feels that way okay without any delay let's get inside straight away and see what do we have on offer over there as uh, as you are all aware isme request sensor nahi aata you get a keyhole slot the door opening knob is over here getting inside is a climb guys ye step isliye diya hua hai kyunki is ground clearance bahut hi acha hai and we are inside this car so guys agar hum competition ki baat kare i think jimny is the only car that is competing directly with the thar but i believe the thar is a much better offering okay because it feels more solid feels more rugged feels more aggressive feels like a proper 4x4 in my opinion iska third mein nahi suna hai aapko third suna deta hu and uh, the doors are pretty heavy and strong plus it's it's got that safety uh going for you as well in terms of global and gap safety rating okay so lot of things are in its favor guys and this ka bhi koi competition nahi hai segment mein to do jimny ke alawa but uh, i would not prefer the jimny in my personal opinion guys i would go for this okay if i have to go for a 4x4 but talking about the ex showroom price guys uh, this is the diesel manual transmission variant which is priced at 16.15 lakhs okay let's do a soft start of the vehicle and see what do we have on offer there you go okay you get the needle swipe you get the thar ka animation which is pretty slow in my opinion but theek hai uh yeah wear seat belt ka warning diya hua hai odometer mein 111 km dikha raha hai you can check the direction of your differential uh you what do you have on the steering let's have a look over here so your music function controls are over here of course you have your cruise control functions over here voice activation is over here you get apple carplay and android auto wired you get abs ebd ESP traction control system lot of systems are there okay in this car guys as well so that's pretty neat uh, this is your 7 inch touch screen over here where you can see media radio adventure statistics android auto and apple carplay adventure statistics mein you get off road ka display over here this is your on road display and uh, this is your custom display for speed odometer pitch gear indicator power engine temperature you can pause it and check it out you have facebook whatsapp and twitter ka option bhi hai either which uh, is not working right now but i believe you can use it okay and uh, that's about it guys uh, you get a clock over here your volume function you can see fm chal raha bhi volume band kiya hua humne <laughs> okay and uh, this is your home menu this is for your radio of course this is for your calling this is for your car information time uh, tyrotronics eco sense and uh, let's go back over here alerts drl data mein nahi around switch on karna off karna aapke upar hai fuel info bhi aapko isme dikh jata hai and this to switch off the infotainment system over here okay the steering wheel over here is not leather wrapped nor is it fabric wrapped it's a fully raw steering wheel over here okay i believe isme cover lagana would be better thoda grip acha milega there is all the mid guys but iska button jo hai badi weird jagah mein hai it is over here all right Uh, I don't know if you can see. Let me just zoom in a little bit. There you can see that MID toggle button is over here. So basically, we're going to use that button. See what do we have? What options do we have on the MID? This is your digital speedometer, of course, and uh, this is your warning history. This is your settings. This is your trip A. This is your fuel economy. Uh, that's about it. This is the center position, the position of the vehicle, of course, of the differential. All right. and that's about it okay very basic very raw very uh, vintage uh, instrument cluster digital dials nahi hai isme of course acha hai i like this setup what are your thoughts guys what setup do you like like digital like analog let me know your thoughts in the comments okay this is your ac setup guys you get your golden borders over here round ac setup hai aise you can use it okay uh, over here you get your uh, single zone climate control which with knobs and buttons okay you get your hazard light function traction control hill descent locking the door seat belt over here warning and uh, 
this is to switch on and off the passenger airbags you get your low, low, low range gear setup over here you get your manual transmission gear setup over here uh, off road ka knowledge mera thoda raw hai i'm still learning so if you feel that i'm making mistakes anyway please educate me in the comment section below guys and i will happily would love to learn from you as well okay you get storage over here as well you get your usb a socket over here you get the aux socket over here and a 12 watt charging socket placed over here so usb c nahi hai storage bahut bada hai yahan pe that's pretty neat this is your handbrake treatment this is for your front window uh, auto window ka buttons over here only for the front rear mein nahi aata of course twin cup holders over here there is no armrest in this car okay uh ye gaadi off roader hai yaar isme aap luxury kaise expect kar sakte ho armrest is luxury it won't feel like off roader so <laughs> armrest hata diya gaya hai this is your glove box treatment which is pretty small in my opinion guys bahut hi chota glove box hai theek hai does the job speaker treatment over there you can see you can see this mahindra thar mahindra limited thar a uh, serial number made in india with pride ye badging bhi dekh sakte ho ye bhi golden finish mein hi hai i don't know if you guys can see in the screen or not but ye bhi thoda golden uh, sandy finish mein hai just like the color of the car okay you get a thar badging over here on the door this is your door uh, handle storage that is your storage over there which is good for a 1 liter bottle but knickknacks ke liye thoda chota hai storage options bahut chote hai isme guys uh, to be honest yahan pe aap dekh sakte ho okay thar written over here also orvms are really big really big and chunky orvms we have fuel warning dikha raha hai hame but theek hai we have to explore you get a manually dimming irvms your sun visor you get a vanity mirror you don't get a vanity mirror over here. you get a ticket holder over here proper off road hai guys this this is a proper if you want to off road na then only buy this car if you like off roading if you want i mean this is not for city drive guys ye ye off roading ke liye bani hai off roading off road as use it as an off roader this is what i feel this is my opinion guys i say it is up to you but this is uh, my opinion guys okay and one more thing i forgot to show you guys you get your auto start stop function over here you get your mid ye to maine dikhai diya aapko aur mid ka bhi toggle options bhi hai like if you select an option you can toggle with these two buttons over here and your headlight adjuster is also present over here all right so that's about it guys from the front of this car uh, this is how it is okay let me know your thoughts what do you guys think and uh, let's get to the rear guys and see what is the space like over there guys if you want to enter the rear there is a knob over here which you need to pull and uh, this tumbles okay moves forward all right and uh, now if i have to move forward of course it's a climb i have to climb the step and i have to get in over here and uh, pull the seat back all right so um it is a decently space guys this is of course uh, seated differently my what driving position hai jo meri i'll go there and tell you how the space of the rear feels like so guys now we are at the rear okay so let me show you this seat is to my driving position uh basically you let me show you what's going on here there's this huge hump on this side over here okay and a hump is over here all right and this is the position of my foot so you get an idea all right of what i'm trying to say uh huge wheel arch over here guys as you can see it's coming right you can see it inside the uh, cabin that the wheel arch ka design pura andar tak aa raha hai and uh, that is another thing okay plus uh, i think if you're sitting in the middle it's much more comfortable okay but uh, over here this the foot position becomes something like this okay uh, you cannot spread your legs like this it becomes like this all right that's how it is i'll show you the headroom and everything so as this huge amount of headroom i have this is a very tall car also it's huge headroom is huge okay uh, you get two adjustable headrests of course two seats yahan pe middle passenger koi uh, headrest nahi hai jagah bhi nahi hai anyway so you can't expect that but the headrests are adjustable and uh, this is the story of the headroom guys let me show you all what else is available over here in the rear there is nothing available in the rear guys the only thing i can show you is the seat belt okay you get two seat belts at the rear roll cage you can see how it is all right pura roll cage aap dekh sakte ho so and uh, it's pretty plain and simple pretty basic this is how the dash is let me know your thoughts looks good good looking car tall car thoda dabangi gaadi hai you know if you on the road uh it uh, of course has a great good amount of road presence this car all right and uh, let's get outside and conclude the video guys so guys before we conclude this is how the key of the car looks like it's a flip key setup lock unlock and this is your horn button over here as you heard 
and uh, the spare key is also a flip key as this car gets no push button start guys okay but you don't get any buttons over here on the spare key but flip key ka option hai so this is the setup of the key hey guys uh, i really apologize i had made the outro for this video but it got lost somewhere uh, i'm unable to find it on my phone so just bear with me for this video it won't happen again uh, i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did do leave a like subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and press the bell notification icon so you don't miss any more future uploads uh, now talking about the thar guys in terms of competition uh, it has gurkha and jimni of course i believe it is much better looking it is more powerful of course and it has the safety rating going for itself as well i believe this car is a pocket off roader okay and uh, you can really abuse this car if you are taking it off roading it's built that way okay it's completely built that way or if you live in an area generally with where uh, it has really bad roads if you live somewhere near there i think uh, this car would definitely do wonders for you because it's high ground clearance all terrain tires and a lot of off roading tech as well okay so it's a very good looking car overall in my opinion and uh, it stands out it's ha it has great amount of road presence as well and it's a very tall car also when you're driving you are in a good position as well it's a good place to be in when you're driving and uh, yes that's about it guys uh, that's my opinion my take on the mahindra thar earth edition uh, please feel free to share your thoughts in the comments as well and i'll see you guys in the next video till then take care and stay safe to wherever thank you so much for joining me bye bye